Anyway, it has been great the last two few days. It's 73 degrees right now. Mostly sunny skies from our uh, Rose City Sky Cam as well as from our Reserve Golf Course Sky Cam. Look at the sun bouncing off the pond there. Very nice. Then we take a look at Cannon Beach. The clouds are definitely starting to push in. Clouds and cooler air moving in. Maybe a couple sprinkles here and there. A few light showers in the morning hours kind of spread out mostly north of Salem uh, in the overnight and early morning hours, but really not much wet weather to speak of. It'll just be a cooler day tomorrow. 78 degrees currently, 76 in Beaverton, 76 in Tigard right now in the upper 70s in Salem, low 60s on the coast. Several spots hit 80 in central eastern Oregon. You will see a cool down tomorrow as well. So the big thing to know, yes, it's going to be cooler and cloudier tomorrow. We'll have a few scattered light shower in, in the overnight hours and early morning hours, but after that we dry out and we'll be warm Warming up after that is just a steady increase in temperatures until uh, actually the day after the 4th of July. So midweek we're looking at 80 degree temperatures. So enjoy tomorrow if you like that cooler, cooler, cloudier weather, which is on the way according to the satellite and radar. And you can see it there kind of filtering in. The clouds are starting to make their way up the mouth of the Columbia and we'll start to see that more and more. But I do think it'll kind of cloud up overnight and our biggest chance of any kind of light shower will be around 530 in the morning tomorrow. So the early morning hours is when you might notice a few light showers. Of course, more on the coast, a few in Portland. Don't think it'll make it all the way down to Salem, but probably more along the I-5 corridor. It dries out pretty quickly and we see more in the way of increasing sunshine throughout the day, but I do think it'll be a much more cloudy day and a much cooler day. Our high temperatures will be in the 60s tomorrow. I also can't rule out a few sprinkles maybe on the coast and a few uh, overnight Monday into Tuesday. But again, not really, really worthwhile wet weather to speak of. So I'll just say a couple morning sprinkles uh, for Monday, maybe a few Tuesday. We warm up Tuesday very quickly after Monday, 76 degrees that day, maybe a couple degrees warmer. By Wednesday, we hit 80 and have a happy 4th of July. Perfect barbecuing weather. We'll see a even warmer day on Thursday. We'll go up a few degrees and then after that some clouds will move in and we'll have uh, slightly cooler temperatures and a chance of showers before we heat up again with sunny skies on Sunday.